Seems to me like it's time for an update, and the update is taking this and turning it into this. A lot has been going on with my Minecraft world as of recent. I made a threat that I was going to stop Minecraft entirely because I got into the Dota 2 beta, but it seems that I am a lot better at Minecraft than I am at Action RTS. Um, I'm a real asset to the other team every, every match that I play. Anyway, this is what I have been working on as of recent. Um, the whole, I haven't named it yet, is done. It is completely, well, completed. Um, the sides are all smooth stone. The bottom's completely lava, except for the part around my chests there. And it's all covered with glass, and it's something to behold. Just get a feeling of how ridiculously huge this hole is. Here, let me make it all fancy for you guys. Here. Check out this hole. This thing is absolutely ridiculous. And if I knew it was going to be this big, I would have definitely made it smaller. But it's not like I'm going to downsize it now that it is done. The mod that I'm using for the glass is called Better Glass. It's perfectly original in the naming, but it really works. In the original texture, um, you couldn't really tell the edges of the glass panes from the bedrock in the end. Um, makes for a much nicer finish. The only thing that I need now is some better anti-aliasing so that it doesn't look like complete static in the distance there. I've completely flattened out the... Um, 9x9 nine nine chunk area around my center point and this is going to be my safe zone and I have gotten rid of all the sand and dug up well dug up and and excavated all the water out from this corner here a ton a ton of busy work um, but it'll be ridiculously big in the end, and that's exactly what I'm going for. I'm planning on eventually putting these archways that I've started here all the way around my... my pit. I'm not entirely sold on what I've done there in the corner. I think I'm just actually going to, uh, tear that bit down and not try to make it all fancy and curved. So I got rid of the mob spawner that I had in the middle of my pit. And I'm putting in a new mob system entirely over in the corner here. And it's actually going to uh, have six installments. Here's two. Another one's going to be right here. And I'm going to have two more out there. Sorry, three more out there. Um, I had this brilliant idea to uh, line the ceiling with unminable blocks. Um, this one's made of gold over here. Because things were getting pretty crazy with the glass. Um... But this one, I had the brilliant idea of lining the ceiling with diamond. And uh, the original idea was actually to line the snow bits also in diamond. But after I got this part of uh, the ceiling done with diamond, I just kind of went, nope, nope, that's it. 
not not doing anymore. That that should be enough. Um, yeah. Uh, everything here is lined with half blocks because I'm going to have slimes all over the place if I don't. And this is going to be expanded at least to that wall there. Um, let's see. This one here is going to be redstone. The next one over is going to be lapis lazuli. And after that I think it's just going to be... I think it's going to be coal and iron and that's just how I'm gonna uh, how I'm gonna do it um, the mob system you see here is a little different than anything I've seen at least maybe you've seen something like it before but I haven't quite um, have a bit of a problem with the squids but whatever um, I'm gonna rework a lot of this but the idea is going to be the same the way this works is I have two sets of spawning floors in a slightly different configuration than what I did a tutorial on. Um, but the mobs, they fall down, and the overwhelming majority of the time, if they fall into the two dunk tanks that I have here, they don't actually take lethal damage. And they form a Congo line, and they all just kind of pile up in one corner not doing anything with them at the moment. I'll have some sort of live mob apparatus to play with them in the end, but I, I haven't gotten quite that far with it yet. And that, my friends, is what I have been up to. Yeah, just, just that. 